Hi guys, welcome back to Off the Pitch, episode 13. Um, I'm Sarah, and... <laughs> Wait! What's up? Here's Tyler. What's up? The Intercontinental uh, WWE Champion. Uh, <laughs> maybe, uh, how about the Intercontinental uh, Off the Pitch Podcast Trivia Question Champion? How about that, huh? No, you bought your way to that. You, you hey, he bought that. Still the champion, it doesn't matter how I got there. Watch watch the last video, the last podcast. Hey, I'm still the champ. Hey, I, he I bought care. it. Yeah. He Most bribed champions him. buy their championship belts. <laughs> it doesn't count. That's how it goes. No. Yeah. Sorry, we're going to rematch today. So, uh... I'm going to take the title. Yeah. Oh, God, that's heavy. Jordan, you take this off me, please. I don't want this weighing me down the whole show, you know? Sorry, I'm going I'm to win today. There you go. Take care of that, please. Thank you. Dude. Come on. Oopsies. You can't disrespect the belt like that. Yeah. That's ridiculous. Golly, dude. All right, well. Welcome back. <laughs> Yeah, welcome to greatness, you know. Uh, it's an honor for you to see me here on camera, uh, you know. Uh, it took a lot to get me here, you know. Uh, yeah. But apparently I've been challenged. Yeah, uh, by me. I'm so gonna win. I got to defend the title, and I'm here to do that, and nothing else. Okay. Well then. <laughs> but before we get to that, I have a question for you. I'm here to defend the title and, and nothing then, else. Oh. <laughs> you scared me. <laughs> I was like, oh my God, she's gone. She's gonna call 911. <laughs> the, the blank stare at your forehead. Yeah, got you. you scared me. I was like, my forehead's looking huge today. <laughs> All right, I'll, I'll participate. What do you got? What do you got? What's All right. up? So, have you heard of the 12th man bias? No, what is the 12th man <laughs> bias? Okay, so it is apparently this phenomena, I guess we could call it phenomena, phenomenon, regardless, that English and German league referees are biased, usually towards home teams. So meaning that the home team will get like fewer yellow or red cards. Yeah. This joke is really dragging on. Yeah, it's actually not a joke. Oh, yeah. you said, do you know about the 12th man bias? And then I was like, no, what's this about? Like a joke, you know? Yeah. But you weren't doing a joke? No. Oh. Uh, okay, so we're talking about like first topic then? Yeah. Okay, all right. What? It, what? <laughs> <laughs> okay, so the 12th man bias is a referee bias um, based on English and German League referees. And... The basis of it is that the home team will get uh, fewer cards, yellow or red. Okay. Um, there's also some other interesting facts I found out about while reading the um, paper. Okay. And it uh, mentions that in the German league, like the team that has a stadium with the track around it, so where the mm -hmm. fans are kind of pushed back, they, re <laughs> they receive more cards that game. Hmm. Yeah. And then the, in the same league, the teams with the stadiums where the fans are closer to the pitch, mm -hmm. they receive less. And so I was thinking, like, well, maybe the ref is, like, so scared that the fans will just storm the field. So, like, let me give out the least amount of cards as possible. Oh, okay, <laughs> so, okay. And then I figured if the fans are All further right. away, you know, he has time to, you know, make right. an escape plan, you know. Interesting. Yeah. Okay. See, I was thinking, like, it'd be the opposite, like, the – where the fans are closer to the pitch, mm -hmm. that's going to be rowdier. They're going right. to get it's going to get more intense of a match. Right. But you so you're saying it's the opposite. Yeah. <laughs> Interesting. Okay. Wait, is Mike Dean involved in any of this? Oh, um, he might be. I don't think he's in a league <laughs> when it comes to referees. He might man. Be. You can't don't put Mike Dean in. <laughs> don't put his name on any of this. But yeah, it's pretty interesting because they did the study over six seasons in both leagues, so it huh. has you know some good analytical data to back it up. So I just thought it's pretty interesting. Weird. Yeah. 12th man bias. Which... So, and it's it's the home teams every time. Yeah. No matter who. Not, obviously there's outliers, but. Sure. The, the, the base in general is like, in general it was the home team. Why? They have more favoritism, just the home team. I don't know. It's, but I mean, it makes sense when you think about it. Like. Sure. 
you know, the home team wouldn't get as much cars because, you know, the yeah. ref might play. You know, they're the home, home team. Home, home field advantage. advantage. Exactly, yeah. As we call it in the U.S. Yeah. 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 So, Tell me more. That was pretty much. Oh, that was the whole thing? Yeah. All right. Interesting. It is. It is. Yeah, I'd love to to learn more about that you, know, <laughs> you don't have any more you just have the raw numbers yeah well i couldn't okay. get access to the full thing it only gave me access to the abstract because it's like a scholarly you, like google scholar here? yeah it's like it's like a scholarly journal You're doing so. peer-reviewed research yeah. For the podcast? <laughs> yeah see that's what i i mean who else dedication is, is doing peer-reviewed uh, data nobody on their podcast you know nobody we got reliable stats here <laughs> yes and we just given you the raw numbers, <laughs> yeah. and you formulate your own opinions <laughs> yeah. on those. You know, uh, I, I think it's interesting that yeah, with the uh, you would think it'd be the reverse in the card mm-hmm. situation, um, the home team thing that makes sense. But I do wonder, like, why is it only English and German leagues? Like, what about the well, other that's did they even look into it? That's true too. Because <laughs> a lot of these things are like, oh yeah, in this place, uh, mm-hmm. this there's this really weird thing going on. It's like, well, did you look into that? Mm-hmm. If that happens anywhere else, and they're like, we didn't know. <laughs> no. no, we didn't want to. <laughs> like, All right, well, this uh, I don't know if this is worth knowing now. <laughs> <laughs> like maybe they just didn't do the research anywhere else true. yet. You know, true. maybe that same stuff happens everywhere. Maybe that's not a weird thing. Mm-hmm. They just have another research or. <laughs> Maybe that is weird. Yeah, because I would, I would, like, surely they would hear about it to go investigate in the other leagues, but I'm I'm thinking there's a reason that there's it's only English and German. I think if you ask any, like, supporter of any club, mm-hmm. they're going to say that the referees are biased yeah. towards their, like, rival club. Yeah. 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 So, I, mean, that's who, I think that's who we should be asking. Just people on the street. What yeah. do you think? You know? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. throw out all the numbers all the peer-reviewed yeah. data just go out on the street see just, what the people think yeah yeah that always works that always goes well. yeah. yeah never get you know crazy outlandish nah, answers no nah, 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 it's nah. definitely safe <laughs> definitely safe that's how i get my news every day i'll just walk oh. outside and say hey what you guys got and, and boy do i learn out. a lot okay. yeah oh man <laughs> where do you live where ah, it's not important <laughs> people respond Okay, so on a much lighter note, um, I actually have a few bizarre football stories that I found doing oh, some research. You said football there. Yeah. I think we got a. I don't know if you saw. We got some funny, funny comments lately. Uh, oh, okay. What a lot of people just don't know what this is. They're seeing these clips out of context on social media, and they just are making assumptions real quick on what we're doing here. Mm-hmm. Um, and yeah, so there's one uh, that caught my eyes. <laughs> He's like, if you're doing a football show, maybe you should call it football. It's like, uh, I don't know, man. If you look at the name of the store, it's called Soccer Shop. We're doing yeah. a podcast for Soccer Shop. Uh, we're in America, so yeah, we're gonna we're gonna call it soccer. So sorry. <laughs> <laughs> that was so funny. He's like, yeah, I know what's going on here, and you're doing all this wrong. And he has just in, you know? severely she, missed yeah. everything that's going on here. You should totally bring him in and have him sit down and just run the whole thing. I would, yeah, let's have him sit down. I'm assuming he's not American. Um, mm-hmm. if he, oh, and then there was he replied to it and said, uh, silly A Americans. So, yeah, like for instead sure. of Ann. Yeah. And then also I think Americans was spelled wrong. There's a lot of grammatical mm-hmm. issues in the yeah. comment. Yeah, he's definitely not. Yeah. So I'd like to talk to him. Yeah. yeah, I think Bring that'd be him fun. In. Yeah. yeah. Find him. <laughs> Just hunt him down. Jordy, can we get him on a call? Yeah. Yeah. Can we pull yeah. that up? Yeah. You can get him on a call? Yeah. I got him right now. Oh. He didn't move. <laughs> See, it with my mind. That's I'm concerning. <laughs> I'm scared. Okay. Next, 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 next. Quickly <laughs> move on. <laughs> okay. So back to the bizarre fo- uh, soccer stories. Sorry. Yeah, I got to get it right. Football. Golly. God forbid. Anyway, so yeah, I have some. Okay. Um, these are actually really funny. I sure hope so. <laughs> so the first one, we're going to call it, give these teams a break. Okay. Um, oh, are you going to give a fun name to each story? Yeah. I would love that. Yeah, please do. Okay. Give these teams a break. All right. So this is from the Isles of Sicily Football. Okay. Which is actually the smallest football league. Is it Sicily... Of- 
off the coast of Italy, yeah. the island. Yes. Yeah. Okay. So right. this league has a total of two teams. Two teams. Um. Okay, and they're calling that a league. Mm-hmm. Why? It's, I guess is the requirement as long as there's more than one team, it's a league. <laughs> it's just, they're like, who we got this week? No, it's the same as last week yes. and the week before that. So and the year before that. <laughs> yes. They play each it's other. It's the same every week. Yeah. We're in a never-ending loop. 17 times they play each other. <laughs> oh, God, that's so many. But the thing is, the good thing is they have three cups, three different cups. They play three different cups. So it's not always a league game. <laughs> they oh play in a cup God. game against each other. So that's fun. This hurt my brain. Do they know? ever mix up the teams? Or? I'm assuming they, they have to. There's no way they play the same like lineup 17 times. Every I feel like week. they do. Imagine that, though. It's the same 11 players. Yeah, like, no one gets a chance. Surely, like, they have to know each other's families. Like, <laughs> it's a real tight knit. Yeah. No, nah, I think both teams hate each other. <laughs> it's probably a real violent match. They're like, uh, every time they go out, we like, oh, we got to take these guys out again. Yeah. Yeah, the name of the team is the Garrison Gunners and the Wolfpack Wanderers. I love the alliteration. <laughs> <laughs> that's fantastic and uh, well who came first that i don't they didn't, they didn't <laughs> say uh, i like to think that like one team came picked first. their name first yeah. and they were like oh yeah we can do that better and then right. they did alliteration as well and they were like whoa you just copied us now yeah and so that's, that's a great way to kick off the rivalry <laughs> on the wrong foot yeah. well yeah there's a, a cup called the Charity Shield that they play apparently it kicks they off play the for season. Charity. Yeah, it kicks off the season, and then you know for the seventeen following weeks they play each other again. So here's a warm up, right. and every game is gonna be the same. Get ready. Uh, <laughs> golly, who are they gonna play? Now? It's the same. Yeah. As the, even in the, the the preseason, I like to think they play like preseason matches against each <laughs> other. Yeah. It's just. Every match that same. both clubs have ever played has been against the other club. <laughs> yeah, I wonder how do you like train? How do you prepare? Like after the first three games, like what? Like how do you even prepare against yeah. it's like the to, same team? I like to think that the managers are trying a new tactic every match. Yeah, like, my, my we gotta try well. something. Like we can't let these guys figure us out. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> and they're just trying new formations every match. You might as well. Is yeah. it an all men's team? Yeah. It's co-ed. Is it co-ed? <laughs> no, it's not co-ed. No, 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 no. It feels like it's just like two rival stores getting together. It sounds like a co-ed in a real league. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no. It's a legit, like, men's league. The There's Iowa be, Sicily football league. They've, oh, I think they've got, like, uh, what, like ultras. Like, yeah. the violent supporters. Yeah. They're going to be in the comments like, you, you idiots. Right. You don't know about our league. Right. That, that's, that's just Amber. great. <laughs> oh, they definitely have merch. Absolutely. The yeah, city yeah, is like yeah. torn in like just half. Like, <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> half is the Garrison Gunners and the other half is the, the Wolfpack Garrison Wander- Gunners. Wanderers. I love the, the Garrison Wolfpack Gunners. Gunners. Yeah, Wolfpack Wanderers. They definitely came second. I had a team on my kit. I had a team on my kit. I had a kid on my team uh, in, uh, I think it was high school. Yeah, it was high school um, at club. And uh, his name was Garrison, and he was the biggest flopper I've ever seen. I mean, he was the if he got touched, he was flailing and flopping around, and it worked. And like being like, I remember like I would be standing out on the wing with whoever was defending on that side on the other team, and just being like having conversations with them throughout the match, like, ah, here we go again, Garrison. And they're like, what? And they just give it a few minutes, and you're going to hate this kid. Right. And then they were like, oh, no. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, jeez. And uh, so having him on the team, we were like, yeah, I don't support it, but also, like, I'll, we'll take the free kicks. We'll right, take, yeah. right. Yeah. That's really funny. <laughs> yeah. But, yeah, I can't imagine playing, like, the same team 17 times. That's, that's Plus the so... cup games that you play yeah. against them. Like... I wonder if they After like, like the third game, you're like, oh, God, here we go again. We yeah. got to do this 14 more times. Yeah. The best of 17. It's the best of 17 yeah. series, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> game to 17 win by 17. Right. I wonder if like one team has went undefeated. Oh, yeah. Just I'll imagine. Like, oh, that's hilarious. Like one dominance. team is incredible and the other yeah. team sucks. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 
<laughs> and then he's like, oh my god, we've got to play them again. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right, so for the next one, I'll call it All Fogged Up. All Fogged Up, okay. Mm-hmm. All right. So uh, this was a friendly match between Arsenal and uh, Dynamo Moscow in 1945. Uh wow okay yeah it's a long time ago. <laughs> it is a long time ago so Do they have like what's, what's sort of what's the <laughs> I wonder what's the footwear situation like in that just whatever they had at that point <laughs> like what are they playing just in, show up in 1945 they play with oh those old leather balls yeah, you know? yeah, yeah, yeah the yeah. little like were they brown and they, yeah yeah I'm yeah, uh, yeah. sure those were real fun to play with. I can't, and then in the fog, you can't see it. You get hit with one of those, you just, you're done. <laughs> you're dead. I'm getting beat with a phone book. <laughs> Did you experience that? Right. Have I experienced that? Yeah. No, nah, that's just what I imagined it being like. Oh. <laughs> it has the same density as a phone book, you know? All right. <laughs> that thick leather. <laughs> the ball's not leaving the ground. Yeah, no. Yeah. No matter how. It just it's like playing it. with a futsal ball. Oh, those are the worst. Things. Yeah, but like thicker. <laughs> you imagine getting hit in the face. Oh, yeah, you're done. Yeah, you're no. done. You're out for the season. <laughs> Go home. All right, so apparently the players, they didn't want to play. They were like, call the game like let us go home right but the ref was like yeah no you're definitely gonna play <laughs> y'all are playing it, wait where was this at it was in arsenal's uh stadium okay yeah all right i'm just trying to think so the war is over mm. one of the wars is over <laughs> yes. another one has just begun on the pitch <laughs> yeah <laughs> and arsenal oh yeah. It, yeah 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 so it's in arsenal and the ref is like yeah you're gonna play you're gonna have to figure it out i like that yeah <laughs> he's like look this isn't I'm getting paid. Right. You know, I'm not, <laughs> I don't care I'm not, what happens. I'm not leaving here without my paycheck. Right. <laughs> like, we can't even see you right now. How are we going to play? And he's like, look, that's not my problem. You guys figured it out. You're professionals. <laughs> right. And so, <laughs> apparently, uh, Dynamo, uh, Dynamo Moscow um, made some subs. Okay. Um, but the fog is so dense and thick that they did not come off the field. <laughs> There's just 30 guys running around. They said at one point they had 15 players on the field. <laughs> <laughs> and so it gets better though. Apparently, someone on the Arsenal team got a red card, got sent off. Okay. But they snuck back on. They just, said, the, they just walked three feet to the yeah. right and then just kept playing. Yeah. Like, they won't see me. And so they snuck back on to you know, continue playing or whatever. Um, and then things took a sad turn. Um, the goalkeeper for Arsenal knocked himself out cold. On the goalpost, <laughs> couldn't see. Was he just like diving to save the ball and didn't couldn't see the post? Yeah. Just smacked his head off it. Yeah. So, <laughs> you know, knocks himself out cold, and this is the great part. So reportedly, the ref is like, "I didn't see anything." <laughs> right. <laughs> right. Reportedly, a fan takes his place. So again, the ref's like, "I didn't see anything." Yeah. So this this game is just chaos. Some guy just runs out on the yeah. on the pitch from the stands. He's like, oh, he's, he saw an opportunity. He took <laughs> yeah, I like that. So I'm a big fan of that. They didn't say I'd... Well, they couldn't see him, so they yeah. couldn't scout him. You know. But yeah, that was that was a lot going on that game. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> what a time, 1945. I would love to witness that. Like as a fan, what are you seeing? I don't think you're seeing. Yeah, well, the people in the stands. <laughs> what are <laughs> they see seeing? <laughs> Oh man, yeah. Like, God, I paid money for this, <laughs> right? Just in a but how cloud? did that fan know? Like, oh my God, the goalkeeper just knocked himself out. Like, he had just go. been sitting right, right behind him. Yeah, like, yeah. Oh, this is my time. <laughs> yeah, and jumps over and goes. Yeah, to the goal. yeah. Yeah. Imagine the, the guy that got sent off. Though, he's like, yeah, no, not today. Right. De- definitely not happening. <laughs> yeah, I like that. Wow. <laughs> wow, that's fantastic. Okay. Yeah. So the last one is just blow the whistle. Just blow the whistle. Okay. And it was a Danish so football game. Too short. Oh, okay. Sorry. <laughs> yeah. Him too. I guess he was there as well, you know, at the game. <laughs> and so it was between Ebelot, Ebeltoft, sorry, and Nor Norager. I'm sorry if I put you Yeah, names. I think you got those right. That sounds good yeah. to me. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So <laughs> Norager was. Wait, the where is this at? Danish. Denmark. Yeah. Yeah. The yeah. Danish folk. Yeah. Yeah. Well, like, I, yeah. it, it, was, it was the it was, Danish Football League is what I yeah. probably should have said. Yeah, but, I got you. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> so, Norasia was leading 4-3, to three and the, the game was coming to the end. But Ebel, Toft, were on an attack, but the ref blew the whistle. The thing is, though, his dentures fell out. 
as he was going to blow the whistle. <laughs> so no one heard it. <laughs> and Ebeloff goes on to score and tie the game. <laughs> that. But were they already on the attack? Though? Yeah, they were. Oh, so he shouldn't have blown the whistle yeah, anyway, but, so they got what they deserved. Yeah, but yeah. the ref called it back. He's like, no, it's oh. not a goal. And they ended up losing the game oh, four to no. three. <laughs> and they protested right after the match. Like, yeah. that's not fair. Like, how dare you do that? But yeah, his dentures fell off. Yeah, I think. And he had to look for them. I think if you're, you're a referee with dentures, maybe it's time to. Call it quits. <laughs> it's time to hang up the whistle. Yeah. 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 And they fell out and he was looking for him. So I guess between the time they fell out and he was looking for him, they scored a goal. <laughs> like a Velma looking for his glasses. <laughs> yeah. Just Ronald looking for his teeth in the yeah. middle of the pitch. Yeah, but he, he did call the goal off and say no. It doesn't count. I blew the whistle. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah. Imagine but the scenes, though. If the referee blows the whistle and no one hears it, did he really blow the whistle? Oh, is yeah. it like the tree in the forest? The tree falls falling? in my house. Does it kill me? You know that type of thing. Yeah, I guess. Is that very, not the same? No, no, it's very different. Oh, actually. Oh. Sure. But moving uh. on. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so now we have the world's greatest jersey. Um, Allegedly. <laughs> it's a fact. Uh, Real Madrid's new away jersey for the upcoming season. Um, I just I love the purple on this it's, jersey. Uh, yeah. And it has air ready technology that wicks your sweat, which is, which is really good. I'm 100% polyester. Well. Yeah, because then this this belt gets hot, sweaty, so I need that the air ready, you know? Yeah. Anyway, this is also made with recycled uh, materials, so, you know, we love that. Love the earth. And yeah, it's my favorite. I like the designs on it. They kind of, to me, look like mountains. Mountains? You see mountains there? Yeah, because like. Oh, yeah, stuck, yeah, yeah. You know? I was looking at the side, yeah. On the front, yeah. Yeah. And the purple's really nice, like purple and black. So. Yeah. I think you call that lavender. Yeah. Lavender purple. Nice, a nice lavender. You know? yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but definitely come to the Winston store and get one. Or any of the stores, honestly. Yeah. We all, all the stores have them. Yeah. So any of the stores. And you can shop online, playwatchware.com. Um, or you can come hang out with us at the stores. We're yeah. fun, you know. I got this bells on. Uh, so, you know, I'll sign autographs and whatnot. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> Such a hater, dude. Yeah, so come get one. Golly. So I have like a couple of scenarios for you guys. Okay. And we're gonna top pick your top three players that you would want for you in that scenario. Okay. So say you're going for a night out, maybe hitting a couple bars. Who are you taking with you? Bars. Um, bars. Do you want me to go first? It's karaoke first. night. Let's say that. Oh. oh it's karaoke, karaoke night. night. Oh, number one, Peter Crouch. <laughs> A billion percent. Okay. He's my first pick. Um, Pogba. Paul Pogba. Ew. Um, I picture... <laughs> I like to picture... <laughs> there. <laughs> you didn't pick Ronaldo. He was in... Well, I don't think he's much of a singing man. Like, you know, yeah. I, I would I, just pick any opportunity to hang out with him. Marcelo. Marcelo? Oh, Marcelo. that's a, I, yeah, that's a good show. I like that. No, I... I it said Pogba. I picture like Pogba and Lingard at a club mm -hmm. just doing like Fortnite dances on the dance floor really? and just everyone hates it. <laughs> oh, God, here they are again. Every Saturday night. Here we go again. These dumb Fortnite dances. <laughs> were they 12? <laughs> just every so, weekend. Golly. Yeah. <laughs> also, I like, I like they're know. annoying with it. I also see him just like rapping or something. Pogba. Oh yeah. So that's why I was like yeah, yeah, yeah. karaoke for sure. Yeah, he would have fun with it. Yeah. 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 Um who oh yeah, who else would I uh for karaoke. Mm -hmm. Is it okay. Um I <laughs> get someone like Conte. <laughs> just like someone that you'd like just always smiling, always having a good time. Just you know, no matter what the scenario, you know he's going to be a good time. Uh. <laughs> okay. Um, I'd probably go with Neymar. Neymar, okay. Yeah. All right, all right. Interesting. Yeah, yeah, he likes he likes mm -hmm. to have a good time. Yeah. yeah. Oh, Ronaldinho. Mm -hmm. Ronaldinho. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, who would my third one be? For some reason, Rudiger. Rudiger? Yeah. I don't know anything about him. Yeah. <laughs> well, he well, looks this goofy. Is your chance to get to know him. Yeah. yeah. Oh, absolutely. I would love yeah. to. Yeah. He looks goofy. So. Yeah. And seeing like some of the clips, <laughs> goofy. Well, this, he is, looks goofy. 
<laughs> like, like he looks like a goofy person. Does he wear the mask? Like the yeah, he has to bring the, the mask injury? to karaoke. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that has to be worn during a karaoke. Yeah, I like to think that he wears that off the pitch. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. See what he did there off the pitch. Hey, you got it. Yeah. Uh, yeah. All right, <laughs> yeah. that's my three. You said your three. Yeah. Um. So, say you know you're leaving karaoke. Okay. You know you pick a fight with the opposing karaoke teams. <laughs> Who's your backup? Harry Maguire. <laughs> you get three yeah. backups. He's fighting bouncers and making <laughs> us. <laughs> They'll take somebody out at karaoke night. Absolutely. <laughs> he's just he's the type of guy that like goes on a night out just looking to pick a fight. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> he's like, who can I beat up tonight? Yeah. Um, I'm gonna have to go with Ronaldo. He's gonna protect me. <laughs> mm-hmm. <laughs> Yeah. You gotta protect his baby. I don't yeah. think he's going out anywhere. I don't think you're getting him out. <laughs> we'll see. Yeah, he's a uh, he's. I real... mean, if I'm there, then he's there. So. Oh right, of course. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I forgot. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> mm-hmm. Um, uh, I want like a like Vidich or something like Vidic. a a Vidic or Ferdinand. Ferdinand. <laughs> like a real strong center back. Yeah. You know. Yeah. Real sturdy. Yeah, yeah. So <laughs> someone that you know is much larger than me, which is most people. <laughs> so yeah. Um, I'm gonna go with Akin Fenwa. Oh <laughs> God, yeah, yes. yeah, duh. <laughs> Definitely. Nobody's coming near you. <laughs> no. Yeah, yeah, no. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's game over. That's all you need. Yeah. Yeah, you don't even need three. You just need one. Akin Fenwa. <laughs> really? Yeah. <laughs> Going on a nice picnic. Was that three? Oh no, I stopped it. That we just need active film. Oh, okay. <laughs> it doesn't matter. Oh, that's it. Yeah, that's Nobody all. Else? It doesn't matter. Who else? <laughs> the one you showed me the picture of earlier. No, that was Charlie Ryan. Oh, he'd be a good earlier. second, Charlie. Yeah. He he's built like a rugby player. Yeah. Mm-hmm. He's huge. Yeah. Um, you going on a nice little picnic? Okay. Maybe having a painting party. Okay. <laughs> Who are you inviting? Is it one of those where it's like a? Uh, they have like an instructor and you paint it upside down and then you flip it around at the end and then it's like no I just meant like maybe throwing some Bob Ross or oh, okay so this you just doing this yourself yeah, this for like fun a vibe okay kind of thing. all right um hmm. I know mine well, <laughs> go ahead because I have no idea uh it's gonna be Ronaldo <laughs> <laughs> yeah I just don't see him having fun it, like he I just said, seems too serious about hmm. like you know his body and making sure he's scoring goals and stuff well, like i don't run on the treadmill while he paints yeah <laughs> yeah he's bringing he's doing a full workout yeah. while you're having fun yeah and then maybe i'll just paint like him doing the workout <laughs> you paint him okay. doing the workout yeah yeah we yeah. were like real romantic you know? <laughs> <laughs> no one else is invited <laughs> no really i was just gonna say it's just him he shows up um, oh yeah. i thought other people were coming up oh. I don't know where they are. Yeah, they canceled. Like, yeah. they pulled in the parking lot and was like, hey, I got to dip out. My cat's stuck in the pool or something. I don't yeah. Know. Yeah. But I'm here. So. Yeah. Uh, he leaves. <laughs> <laughs> he I, wouldn't do that to he me. He doesn't say anything. He just is like, nah. He just walks I'm just he would, around. He would not do that to me. So. Uh, yeah, I don't know. Um, Peter Crouch. I don't know. <laughs> it's just always my go to. I don't, because I would just, uh, I would never be in this situation, so I'm having to really. Okay, I can come up with a different one. All right. Say, say in Bali, no, you're moving into a new house. Who's helping you move in? I can Finwa, Traore. Yeah. Say people. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Okay. Uh, um, they'll just lift everything. Yeah. I won't have to do anything. <laughs> pretty much. That's pretty you said good. you're going on a road trip. Oh, I like that. Okay. Um, <clears throat> I need like. Where are you going though? Like, pick your destination and then who you take it. Uh. Going to. Um. Oh, oh Charlie's. <laughs> You're going to Charlie's. <laughs> <laughs> I said vacation, not dinner. <laughs> I'm hungry. Hey, that's a vacation. <laughs> you ever been to Charlie's? Especially oh, Charlie's. on Wednesday, a free pot. Right, <laughs> the original of Charlie's. Was that Irish? Yeah, Irish. Um, yeah. yeah, well, we're going to Charlie's. I don't know where you're going to go. So. Go to like, uh, yeah, I'm not going. Yeah, these are separate events. Yeah, yeah so. Yeah. Um, 
my three would be hmm probably I'm definitely taking like Mallory Pugh okay all right um Ronaldo because he has to pay for my dinner <laughs> <laughs> and I guess I'm and dessert and but the you pie is free ice cream out. We're going on Wednesday where the pie is free. Like, they have the free slices on there. I mean, oh, yeah. Ronaldo's paying. Why are you worried about money? Because I don't want to use all his money. Like, <laughs> I got to, like, think consider... got him for the next however many years. He could buy the entire menu for everyone in the building. That is true, but, like, has I'm still a considerate Hundreds person. of millions. I, I just can't be spending my man's money like that, you know? <laughs> so, um... Not like, even in this hypothetical situation. Yeah. <laughs> being realistic so with it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, the last girl like Sarah. I know, right? <laughs> like, no, I'm just kidding. Um, who's the last person? Instagram handle on the bottom. <laughs> right. Tag him. Um. Hmm. Neymar. Yeah. You do Neymar. Yeah. Neymar. Um, I'd like to do Vegas with Ronaldinho. That sounds like a really and good time. Just see if I survive. <laughs> like uh, and then I'd also bring along. Um, I would like to see how Paul Scholes would do in that situation. He seems mm. like a very reserved <laughs> <laughs> guy. You would scare him. So, well, I think he would. I would just like to see what he's like in situations like that. Um, and then to make him comfortable, we'll bring along Rooney. Okay. <laughs> so, <laughs> and, you know, I don't think he's ever had anything happen on a night out before. I don't think anything's ever happened with him. He's yeah, just a no. pretty calm, reserved guy. I don't For think sure anything not. is normal. <laughs> yeah. All right. So now we have the official match ball for the La Liga 2022-23 season. Um, this is the one the players are using on the pitch. And we also have the training ball as well. So this ball has 12 panels and reduced seams for a lighter feel and the grip is going to be better for rebounding and a better touch on the ball i mean i don't even see the seams right I mean, you talk about crazy. reduced yeah <laughs> invisible <laughs> for real <laughs> but i really love this ball the colors are nice um it feels really light in my hand and i can feel like the texture of the balls so. and i can tell you as a as a champion myself i can tell you uh this ball is a ball for champions let me tell you there's a reason he's not holding it <laughs> so yeah Come to the store and get the ball. <laughs> Attention! <laughs> that was good. Oh, man. So we have trivia. I'm going to ask some questions. This belt's on the line today. You mm. know, Tyler had it last time. Yeah. He bought it, though. He did buy it. I did buy the um, belt, yes. But we're not going to disclose that information, <laughs> even though we just did. We cheated. But winner gets this. It's gonna be me. We'll see. Golly, uh, the people are excited. <coughs> yeah, I tell you what. Golly, that was fantastic. Let's go. I'm ready. Give me the question. First question. Let's go. Okay, hold on. Who is the current chief executive of the Premier League? Gary Linker, Richard Masters, Alan Shearer, and Neville Southall. Uh, my guess would be Neville. I'm gonna go with Richard. Richard is correct. I knew it was either Richard or Neville because it's definitely not Alan Shearer or Gary Lineker. So Sarah won, Tyler zero. Which countries participate in the Premier League? There's two. Yep. Okay. Are we saying at the same time or? Well, no, we go. You, Sarah, you go first, then Tyler, and I'll take yeah. who's right. Um, England and Wales. Yeah, England and Wales. That's correct. Yeah. Um, true or false is... The Premier League, the most watched football league in the world. Ooh. True. I'll say true. It is true. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I think the second would be La Liga. Mm -hmm. And then I was like, I don't think that is as global as the Premier League, just yeah. because of, like, broadcasting and stuff. Yeah. Yeah. Next. Uh, <laughs> how much did it cost to build the new Arsenal Stadium? Uh, how are we going to do this? <laughs> okay, so do you want me to give you options? Yeah. Okay, so I'll reread the question. No, nah, I think we just say a number and whoever's closest. It's in euros, though. Okay. All right. Um, say so yeah, hundred million euros. Let's 
say 250 million. Um, Tyler, you're closer. Yes. But God you're both Lee, wrong. You suck. <laughs> 390 million euros. Oh, okay, yes, I wasn't close. <laughs> Are you were closer than Sarah was. Yeah, 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 I'll take oh it, I'll take God. it. Who were the first champions of the Premier League? Leeds, Arsenal, Liverpool, or Manchester United? I'm going to go with Leeds. I will say... I feel like if it was Arsenal, then every Arsenal fan would say that all the time, and they would never let that go. But also, I might just not be in touch enough to know. And I don't think Liverpool... I'll say Manchester United. Manchester United is correct. I knew that. Yes. yes. Golly. <sighs> Give me the belt. For the win, who is the Premier League's all-time top goal scorer? Wayne Rooney, Michael Owen, or Alan Shearer? I'm going to go with Alan Shearer. Yeah. That's correct. Yep, 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 yep. <laughs> Give me the give me the belt. Okay, well not if you're rude about it. Uh, dude, I'm the <laughs> champion. Here, please. I'm the champion. Give me the belt. Please? No. <laughs> yes. Thank you. Yep. Oh, you don't have to like hold it like that. I don't think Sarah's gonna take it. Oh. All right. As you can see, he's never won anything before in his life. <laughs> By the way, he's holding that trophy, so. Or belt, whatever it that is. Thing whatever that is. Yeah. Uh, I'll have you know, I won most improved on my challenge team in 2005. Why are you bragging? So. <laughs> that, speak, that says a lot, guys. <laughs> like, that says a lot. <laughs> Golly. That's, this is real gold. Solid palladium gold. Huh? It's not, guys. This palladium gold. The best kind? <laughs> palladium. Just neither of those things are real. <laughs> I know. Just start mixing elements. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how chemistry works. <laughs> I took it twice in college. Because you failed the first time? Ah, well, that's not important. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Hey, by the fourth one, I had that stuff down. That's you should. <laughs> I hope so. All right. Uh, thank you guys for tuning in. Yep. To the off the pitch episode thirteen. Yep. Thanks. Um, Thanks, guys. Appreciate it's it. It's been fun. The trivia game did not go how I wanted it to, but it's okay. Not next time. Yeah. You next know, time I'm back, I'm gonna turn win. on the video. You know you're gonna see greatness, and that's why I'm here. What are you doing? I'm wearing my belt, dude. Do you just leave me alone? All Sorry. right. Golly, yeah. I swear. Make sure you like this video, comment, subscribe. Uh, yeah, do all that. Yeah. Play Watch Wear on all of our socials. Yep. And yeah, see you guys next Playwatchwear time. Playwatchwear.com. Yes. Uh, you can shop online. Uh, you can also come into the stores. That would be cool. Uh, we like that. Yeah, we'll we do. We'll have the belt display. Yeah. Want to see. Nah, I'm not. This thing will get stolen. No one By who? That. Uh, are you kidding me? No one wants this? <laughs> yeah, all right, dude. Sure. Anyway, see you guys later. <laughs>